HoloLive just dropped a dumpster truck ton of absolutely banger figures, and oh my god, I am gonna be broke. <laughs> and so are you, if you have bad spending habits like me when it comes to anime figures. And Leo from the future here to tell you that you can spend even more of your money. You could have more bad spending habits with Otaku Lamps. Look at that. You can get a great 20% off if you download their brand new app and 10% off every order after that with my code MOZOLO at the checkout. Not only would you be supporting me and this channel, but as well as these amazing Otaku Lamps. Look at that. This is a Gargura one. Oh man. The good folks over at Good Smile literally have just dropped an absolute dump truck load of anime figure announcements as they do every now and then every few months. And Hollow Life figures were a major bunch of them. So I decided why not go through all of them and check them out. First one, we've got the, the finally have the colored up painted version of the Mori Calliope Figma. Pretty sure last time we saw this it was like it was like this where it was unpainted it was just the sculpt but speaking of unsculpted unpainted i mean we have the lapless one no one saw this coming i mean oh my god that is adorable i'm not gonna lie i'm not that big of a fan of figmas i don't know I've, i'm much more of a nendoroid kind of guy myself or just a regular scale figure by the way, you could totally just see all the figures down here, so it's just absolute spoiler. But next up, I, as I said, I'm not that big of a Figma fan, but this Gargura, I might just have to cop, not gonna lie. <laughs> Here's the Papa Parade um, of Mori Calliope now, painted. Honestly, it, it's really a toss-up for Papa Parades. It's... It's really 50-50 on quality. It's the pop-up parade figures. The quality is not very consistent. <clears throat> but I don't know. This one looks pretty good. And then, of course, did not see this coming at all. But we got a Laplace pop-up parade as well. It looks adorable. I love Laplace. I believe this is a... Yep, this is another pop-up parade for... Ayame. Shion love Shion. Honestly, as much as I, I, as much as I said about Paparazzi being 50-50, ugh, oh, these are very tempting. But now this, this is an absolute insta pre-order. Whenever the pre-order drops, instant pre-order. This is a must-buy. I mean, oh my god, this is absolutely pog champ. This is beautiful. I, I, I think about this every every second since I've seen it now <laughs> and the hollow live nendoroids just keep on coming and my god I don't think I honestly don't know if I'm gonna be able to afford all of this not gonna lie but who cares I'll go broke buying all of these I love hollow live and I want every single nendoroid we have Botan we have freaking Watame we have Lamy we have Aki Oh my god, I mean, th this blue, I don't know, this blue looks just, it's very nice. Can, can I just mention that? We have freaking Kanata, Laplace as well, all of Gen, Gen X, which is crazy. Louis, Hakui, freaking Chloe, the Chloe one looks so good. Is it just me? I mean, I, I've said this in my previous Nendoroid unboxings. Nendoroids have just been getting so, so so high quality in my opinion. I mean, look at this. This looks insane. This Chloe one, that I'm probably most definitely gonna get that. As well as every single other one. This Iroha one, my god. Absolutely adorable. And then this, we have a random Laplace scale figure. Laplace is getting a lot of love right now. I mean, my god, this is a really nice figure. And I don't know, this might just be speculation, but the way they made the base. I would imagine, I could imagine that they would do like a connecting base kind of thing, or like matching bases for the rest of Hollow X. We'll see. But this, this next figure, oh, I called it. I feel like I mentioned this in a previous video at some point. If not, I mentioned it in like some chat or something. But here it is. Bam! The freaking Pekora 1 4th scale bunny figure. 
freeing, by freeing, by freeing the people who make these. The, the, the goddamn company, company that makes these figures. And if you know, freeing one-fourth scale bunny figures, whew, man, are they pricey. But it is the highest of quality that you can probably get from like a, a sub $500 figure. And my God, it, 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 I'm gonna own this, <laughs> 100%. When this when this pre-order drops, kaboom! It's in my cart. It's in checkout. It's ordered. I mean, this looks this looks amazing. We, I knew I knew that this was gonna come. I knew that this was coming. I mean, it's Pekka, Bunny, Freeing. I mean, come on. It's like a match made in heaven. Now this isn't Hollow Live, but I mean, if you know, you know. Oh, we got the freaking K-San from V Shoujo Nendoroid coming. Let's go. I'm probably going to get this as well because if you know, you know, couldn't get one. Stash 07, never forget. As well as this. I mean, come on. Let's go. This is... VTuber fans are winning. VTuber fans are absolutely winning now. And now, one that wasn't announced by uh, Good Smile. But I am very, very excited to mention and talk about is BAM! Bruh. Move my camera. I mean Of course if you if you're uh, if you keep up with Hollow Live and all that, this figure would look pretty familiar. It's from the Super Expo last year in twenty twenty two where they showcased it. The they had a life size version of it. I think it's down here actually. Yeah, there is. That's the life-size version of it. And yes, they're selling it for at a one-seventh scale, which is absolutely that's that's a good size. That's a very nice size. Let me see. I think if I remember correctly, this is a one-seventh scale right here. This is one-seventh scale. So like right next to my head. I mean, I have a pretty big head. Um, I guess I don't know what else can I do for reference. My mouse here it is. So it's it's big. It's a big figure, <laughs> not too shabby at all. And I'm, all, and I mean, my God, am I excited? I have been staring at like these photos, these, these pictures for like the past hour. It's the only thing that's been on my mind. My God, am I excited? I'm gonna goom. I mean, I mean, if you know me, and if you've seen my previous videos or like been on this channel for quite some time now, you would know that I absolutely love Gargur. And, and can I just say, I already pre-ordered this straight off of Ami Ami. Oh, uh, it's, it's, it's so sad that it comes out literally next year. Literally next year. February 2024. Uh, it'll be worth the wait though. My god, is this a beautiful piece of art. It's not even a figure anymore. It's literally, it's literally just art. Like, this is just art. Oh my god. God, but yeah, that's pretty much it for my rant. <laughs> I honestly don't know what spurred spurred me to make this video. It was just a, <laughs> I, don't, I really don't know. I guess it is what it is. I just wanted to rant about these amazing Hollow Live figure announcements. But yeah, I'll leave a link down in the description to all the stuff we just checked out. As always, guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe for more anime content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.